Welcome to the Nano Bioelectronics Laboratory. My name is Adar Ben Yoav and my research team focuses on interfacing biology with microelectronics. In particular, we study how bioelectronic signals transfer between biological materials such as DNA, proteins and cells and micro and nanoelectronic devices. We harness these unique bidirectional signals for the development of the next generation of personal health monitoring applications such as electronic skin patches for biosensors. So come on in and meet our team and the skills we have in our lab. Welcome, my name is Shudhis. Our team is very excited to investigate how biological materials can be modified and affect the ways electron transfer at the interface with the electronics. In order to study these questions, we design and fabricate these bioelectronic interfaces with some of them you will see in a moment. Then we study this integration of these interfaces in the miniaturized lab on chip devices with the goal to implement in real world scenarios where bioengineering application can be revolutionized. Welcome to NBL. Hi everyone, I'm Abia. Another aspect of our work is dealing with biological materials. For example, here we culture prokaryotic and eukaryotic cells. Later, we study the behavior of these cells in microscale environments using the lab and chip devices. Hi, my name is Rajendra. I am a PhD student. Part of our work is to design and fabricate the lab and chip devices. For that, we use different micro and nano fabrication techniques such as photolithography and chemical vapor deposition. We develop different lab on chip technologies such as microfluidics and microsensor arrays. Hi everyone, my name is Guy. We also explore other fabrication technologies. For example, we investigate the use of 3D printing for the development of new bioelectronic devices. This approach allows us to rapidly manufacture different prototype devices that will later be explored in different biomedical applications, such as biosensors. Hi, I'm Stav. We also very much like electrochemistry. We use electrochemistry to analyze the nanoscale bioelectronic interface. We also use electrochemistry to probe radox active biomolecules and to study the underlying biological mechanism. The electrochemical information that we acquire can be used to explore new bio biomedical approaches, such as the diagnosis and treatment of cancer and neurological disorders. Hey, my name is Alo. After building the micro devices and measuring the bioelectronical signals, we use signal processing to decode the molecular information. For example, we utilize machine learning algorithms to extract important information about the redox active molecules from the electrochemical data. We also utilize deep learning methods to differentiate new biochemical information about our body that so far was not accessible and can be used for biosensing application in the world of the Internet of Things. So thank you for joining us and we look forward to seeing you.